Jay Gurudev for the Age of Enlightenment. Ringing the bell of invincibility for every nation. His Holiness, Maharshi Mahesh Yogi. Inspiration for starting the advanced techniques of the Transcendental Meditation Program. Lecture 1. Maharshi's Advanced Techniques of the Transcendental Meditation Program. With narration by Dr. John Hagelin, 2010, Director of the Transcendental Meditation Program for the United States, and testimonials by course participants of the Advanced Technique Program. Maharshi's Advanced Techniques of the Transcendental Meditation Program. Advanced Techniques of the Transcendental Meditation Program enhance and enrich the benefits of one's daily practice of the TM technique. Through the regular practice of the Transcendental Meditation technique, the mind becomes familiar with the experience of pure consciousness, the simplest, least excited state of consciousness. Through advanced techniques, we enhance our ability to experience finer levels of thought, to develop finer perception while becoming more and more familiar with the experience of our own silent self. As our conscious mind thereby becomes more infused with this pure field of consciousness and our perception becomes more enriched, our thoughts and actions spontaneously become more powerful and effective, resulting in greater fulfillment of desires in daily life. The advanced technique of transcendental meditation is a program which is much more valuable than the technique of transcendental meditation. First we must start with the technique and then having gained the familiarity with finer fields of thinking process having experienced over and over again, many times in each sitting, the finer values of the mantras, our conscious mind becomes familiar with the finer fields of thinking process and then takes a dive into the transcendental consciousness. Having done this quite a lot, having become familiar with all these finer well, uh, levels of thinking process, Advanced techniques give an impetus to the absorption of the unified field in the, in the, on the level of conscious mind. Hmm? As you do the sponge, sponge in water and then water uh, goes away and then you put the sponge and again the sponge becomes full of water. So it is uh, a sort of process where the unified field gets more and more soaked into the quality of conscious mind. Conscious mind comes out with more and more fullness of the total value of natural law in our daily activities. So advanced techniques are to have a more fast grip on the unified field so that every phase of our thought and action is more and more fully supported by natural law. In that, in a very spontaneous manner, what develops is invincibility. What develops is spontaneity of 
gaining results without obstacles. Because the functioning of natural law is completely frictionless, completely frictionless. No obstacle on the way. So when our conscious awareness becomes more and more soaked with natural law, every thought, every desire, every understanding, every behavior, every exchange with the environment becomes more and more supported by the evolutionary power of natural law. All those values of perfect order, of continuum, uh, which we say immortality, all these values begin to be lively in our different phases of daily living. All these values of the unified field begin to be lively in different phases of daily living, in all phases of daily living, in a very spontaneous manner. This is the practical, hmm, if I want to use the word, this is the practical miracle of the advanced techniques of transcendental meditation. What I am explaining is the, the speed and the thoroughness, two values, more profound absorption of natural law in, in our awareness and more speedy achievement of fullness of that natural law in all phases of daily living. This is the outcome of the practice of advanced techniques of transcendental meditation. It should not sound to be an exaggeration, even though It is right that when we have a picture of advanced technique which brings in more speedily the infusion of full potential of natural law in all phases of daily living, it does appear to be astounding. It does appear to be, hmm, how can it be? Can a man gain mastery over natural law? To this question I have a big yes. Transcendental meditation practice for some time, and then the advanced techniques, and then one advanced technique, two advanced techniques, three, four, five, advanced technique after advanced technique. This is a royal road to mastery over natural law. Like the TM technique, advanced techniques are effortless, natural, and simple to learn and practice. They have their source in the oldest tradition of knowledge on earth, the Vedic tradition of India. To ensure that these techniques will always be offered in their full purity and effectiveness, Maharshi selected the most experienced Vedic experts and then gave them additional training and expertise. These highly skilled teachers are now touring, offering these profound advanced techniques to accelerate the development of human consciousness. My first advanced technique, with the benefit of hindsight, I can say now that it seemed to mark a turning point in my life. Um, it, my life began to take a different direction after that. It became a lot more purposeful in my activities and since that time I've had ever increasing amounts of bliss occurring during daily activity um, starting almost the same day or uh, the same weekend as I had the advanced technique and this has sort of grown periodically over a period of time over the last 18 months um, which is very pleasing. <laughs> La technique avancée m'a beaucoup aidé in activity uh, the advanced technique helped me a lot. 
mainly to be much more efficient and much more productive, but also to be more competent, to take on more responsibility. As soon as I took the first advanced technique, I was appointed deputy editor of a newspaper I was working in at that time. It was the same experience when I learned the second advanced technique. Three days after I learned that technique, I was appointed the chief editor of this newspaper. It happened that each time I learned a new technique, I received a promotion in my job. It's difficult to put into words, but the experience has been very, very profound since doing the first one. I've noticed definitely in my day-to-day -day life and my relationships with other people that there's a lot more love and a lot more smoothness of feeling on the heart level. And also I've really, really noticed that intuition is so strong. Yeah, meditation is fine, but you want to do more and more. You want to do as much as you can. And that's why I wanted to do the, the advanced technique to, uh, to accelerate my uh, development. Maharshi developed a series of four advanced techniques to accelerate our growth to enlightenment. The first advanced technique takes specific advantage of our time of sleep at night to support the growth of higher states of consciousness. Meditators can apply to learn this first advanced technique after four months of regular TM practice and can then continue with the sequence of advanced techniques after every additional four months of regular practice. Each technique is like changing into a new gear for faster and smoother evolution. Completion of the sequence of advanced techniques is a prerequisite for learning the TM City program. During the uh, activity, I feel more unshakable. You know, this pure consciousness, which is more stable during meditation, is also present in activity. Um, despite the, the problems or the tensions outside, we can feel this deep silence, which is always unshakable. This is what I feel with this second technique. I feel that the advanced technique was a great breakthrough. It gave me a feeling of freedom, of rejuvenation, of opportunities in life. It really was an opening for me. Each advanced technique is a great opening. Both the width and the depth of my horizon expanded so that during any observation I recognized deeper laws of nature. I realized, aha, here is just a repetition of a basic underlying pattern of natural law. With my first advanced technique, I noticed that I was able to integrate much better what I was feeling inside and my surroundings. My perception was much more refined and much more unified. There was a great experience of unity with my environment and with the people I was relating to. I think uh, these were the results of the advanced technique because for the first time now in my life I feel free as I never felt before. And I feel free um, in the day-to-day -day life. I feel free with my thoughts, with everything. And it's a really great experience I had.